Hey yo, what up people? This is your boy Jay Sanjay Cakes and today we are back with another video. And for today's video guys, we're gonna do a real versus fake because I want to help you legit check this popular shoe that we have inside of this box. Let me give you a sneak peek of which shoe we have in the box before we go into the video. Cool. Now, before we go into this real versus fake, please let me ask you to go and hit the thumbs up if you're liking the content. Also go and subscribe to the channel if you haven't already. Activate the notification bell so you can be notified whenever I upload a video, which is every single day, guys. Also go follow me on my Instagram and on TikTok as Jason J Kicks. And now let's begin this video. First, let me tell you guys, this video is just for educational purpose because this shoe is really popular and this shoe is one of the most replicated sneaker ever. So as you can see right here, I have my bread Jordan 1 and inside of this box, we have the wrap of this shoe. So let me open the box and see what we have here. Look at the box. No red stamp on this one. Okay, okay. Here we have the size label, the OG size label. Do you remember when shoe used to cost 160? <laughs> Man, what's this? Oh, we don't need this, we don't need this. Uh, tissue paper here. And here we have the shoes. Look at this, man. You see why I'm telling you you need to be careful? These is why I'm telling you to be careful. Yo. Okay, okay, yo. Um, let me put this back here. And let me take that box away. So we ain't gonna need it anymore. Now look at the shoe. First, let's forget for a moment about what this shoe is. I want to talk a little bit about the colorway of this shoe. This is iconic, man. The Bread Jordan 1 is iconic, iconic though. Really good shoe, really beautiful shoe. Now I'm going to take my pair, my retail pair, my real pair from this clear box and we're gonna process with this video. And now here we have both of the shoes and yo, red one, it's a classic man, really classic. So take a quick look at this replica, look at that. Leather quality seems to be really good. That Wings logo looks good. That's why you need to be careful because these are not trash wraps. These are high quality ones actually. So you need to be careful. The leather is fantastic. We need to call things like they are, you know? So let me take this shoe tree out. The shoe comes with this carbo shoe tree. And look at that leather quality though. I'm telling you, be careful here. Look at the shoe on the inside. We have even the number here. Then we have that insole, I have the size tag. Now, this is my pair. Look at that nice shoe, man. I love this shoe. I love this shoe. Look at that. Yo, I love this shoe so damn much, man. But let's go with a comparison between these so we can legit check this beast. First, I have to say that the shade of red is not the same. This red is a little bit more vibrant here on the UA or fake whatever than on the retail pair. Look at that. This is like a slightly more muted red than on this one, but they look like kind of close. You need to have your retail pair side by side in order to notice this. The Winx logo seems to look good. A little bit more shiny on the UA pair, but Overall, looks looks really, really good. So be careful, but yeah, the shade of the red is not the same. You can use this 
to legit shag your shoe also i can see here that this one the ua is a little taller than the actual retail one you can see it clearly here let me see if i can get a little closer right there you can see it the ua is actually taller than the retail one now into the leather quality we go let me see this leather quality feels the same i gotta say it feels the same though the quality feels the same in the red area on the wings logo doesn't feel the same this one seems to be a little bit more flat here on the ua than on my retail pair look at that you can see it here let me see here yeah boy you can clearly see it here this one is a little bit more flat than the actual retail you can see by the edges yeah 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 black leather quality this one seems to be a little bit more like uh how can i call this tumble like i don't know it feels a little bit more soft on the ua i actually like the way it feels on the ua more than it feels here but good quality in both of them is just not the same so yeah a lot of quality will look good but won't be the same now let's see the toe of the shoes the shade of the red is not the same on the toe either and I can see a different shape on um, both of these shoes. You can see it here, like how this one goes. It's not as rounded as on the UA pair. You can see that clearly here. Leather quality. Yeah, it's not the same on the toe as on the real one. We can see it here. This leather feels and looks super nice on the retail pair. And here, nah, not that much, not that much now let's see what we have in the tongue and again the shade of red is different it feels feels about the same not too much to look here they just feels the same numbered on the inside I don't know. I don't know. Let me know if you see something here. Let us know in the comment section. And to tell you something about the auto, what can I say? This is a pretty warm pair. This is brand new. But you can see the usual Jordan 1 auto. That's what you're going to get in this one. The midsole. Let me see. Now let me see the midsole on this one. Midsole looks about the same the shape mm, this one the UA seems to be a little bit more fat on the shape of the toe not the same as this one you can clearly see this here and let me see the shape on the back of the shoe this one uh, the real one has more the hourglass look than on the fake one seems to have this super straight look but uh, I hope I help you uh, with this shoe because this is a really popular one and a lot of people are selling this one outside and I don't want you to get scammed. That's why I'm doing this video, guys, to help you in this crazy market because nowadays, man, these shoes are looking good. We got to call it like it is. These shoes are looking really, really good. Guys, if you saw any difference that I didn't mention on the video because I didn't see it or I don't know. I'm a human being. We make mistakes. Let us know in the comment section. You're free to join the comment section to tell us any difference that I didn't mention probably because I didn't see it or whatever. Thank you guys for watching the video. If you enjoy the content, hit the tone up, subscribe to the channel for more content like this. Follow me on my Instagram and on TikTok for anything you need. This is Jason J Kicks. I can help you with you checking your shoes or whatever. Right here, Jason J Kicks. Thank you a lot for watching again. Until the next one, goodbye.